thousands of dollars of expensive lawn care equipment is missing tonight after thieves hooked up a trailer at a storage facility and drove off with it all. Now police hope you can help catch these crooks, but there is a unique twist in this story. News Channel 5's Jason Lamb joins us tonight to explain. Jason? Well, that's right, Carrie. There are two interesting things at play here. First, there was another possibly connected robbery from the same storage facility about a week earlier. And second, how the thieves potentially got inside. Lance Sutton is working today at his lawn care business thanks to friends who loaned him all this equipment. After all, his was stolen. Three mowers, uh, two trimmers, a backpack blower, of course the trailer itself. Surveillance photos from the Cube Smart storage facility on South Church Street in Murfreesboro show the thief's truck. A 1980s or 90s burgundy Ford F-150 extended cab with step sides and trim on the side, hooking up Lance's own trailer parked in a locked, fenced-in area and driving away with it all. $15,000 worth of equipment. It's pretty heartbreaking that uh, somebody can uh, stoop that low. Police are investigating whether another trailer theft at the same storage facility about a week earlier may be related. So how did the thief get in? Lance says it was right through the open front gate. He says CubeSmart told him only after his trailer was stolen, the gate had been broken for weeks. It's been left in the open position for several weeks, allowing anyone to come in and out as they please. And Lance says that was still the case even last night when he took this cell phone video. It is 10.04 at night and the security gate for Cube Smart storage is wide open. Murfreesboro police say they're trying to track down who took Lance's equipment. I have nothing to say to them. I just want to see him brought to justice. And as for the storage facility, Lance says he's weighing legal options after he says his livelihood was loaded up and driven out the front gate. I wouldn't allow the, the gate to go this long malfunctioning. We contacted the local storage facility and the regional manager for CubeSmart. They said they weren't allowed to comment on the situation and they referred us to their corporate office. We have not heard back from them. Carrie.